So ladies and gentlemen, it's Katara 5000 with Emma Jude on her very last day here at the boat. Actually, yesterday was considered her last day. <laughs> Today she is leaving. She's packed up. Packed up. That's it. Oh my god, I loved it so much. It was such an adventure. I can't wait for my next ship. I also can't wait for a break. <laughs> right, 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 right. What, were your, what was your first day like? My first day, oh my gosh. Honestly, my first my first day performing, it was probably like my best performance ever because I remember I was in the atrium and I sang Feeling Good in my head. It's funny what the atrium is. The atrium is uh, where the elevators are and you've got lobby. a little, the the lo lobby. it's the lobby. Okay. <laughs> and no, but you've got like a bunch of floors and all the balconies looking down at you. I had every single balcony full and they're all cheering for me on my first song and I was like, oh, I'm meant to be here. <laughs> Emma Jude, ladies and gentlemen, the, the, the original Emma Jude, the only one. Hey, <laughs> so. Um, so, uh, what, did, what, were your, what were the things you learned over the course of this past four months? I don't know, I've just learned that if you just try to be a good person, then good things will happen. That's what I think. What was the craziest story that you could tell us off the top of your head? I don't think I could tell you that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Any last words for the people? You're beautiful. I mean, you're beautiful. Yeah, you, you, you'll, you'll see us together you're again someday. So we only We only did one video together, uh, but we'll do more in the future. Mm. It was beautiful Back in video. New York. Yeah, back in New York. Yeah. Right. Okay. Bye, Emma. Okay. It was a pleasure working with you. Thank you. <laughs> right. Okay, let's go get some time. <laughs> so there you have it ladies and gentlemen that was me saying goodbye to a beloved crew member um, this is something that happens very often on ships because uh, people have different times that their contract starts and different times where their contract ends so whoever you make friends with whoever you become close to eventually um, is going to part with you in some way uh, whether whether it's temporary or permanently uh, you know there are ways to get on the ship that someone's going to but usually that's Usually they only make arrangements for that, well, with that for married couples, uh, but um, that's the nature. I've seen people separate because one con one person's contract is over, uh, and they live in a different country. Sometimes, sometimes that both contracts are over at the same time. But if they live in it, they live in a different country. They have to just communicate through Facebook and email and stuff like that. Where uh, a long time ago, when they were when they were in their contract together, they used to communicate face to face. And they can't do that anymore because that's just that's just how it goes. So um, I've seen people cry really hard when their best friend leaves, and uh, or their boyfriend or their girlfriend or something. And uh, yeah, that's just that's just the way it is. Some people have come to accept it. Some people have gone through it over and over again and still cry each time. Um, but you know. It's kind of the way life is. Really, at the end of the day, you only have yourself, so you really have to be happy alone. <laughs> um, I have a friend who who built a family on the ship. Not had kids, but she she basically took her friends and labeled them mother, father, brother, sister, uh, and stuff. And they're all gone now. And so. <laughs> Yeah, kind of sad actually. So she spent a few days crying, but she's okay. She'll be fine. Anyway, um, I have a lot of shows to do. My contract is almost half done. Um, I'm get I'm starting to get into the swing of recording videos, so you should see a lot of updates in the future. So I'll see you later. Yeah. No, they, there's a there's a horse on on its way. Oh, actually, a pony. A flying pony. Right there, that's my ride. Oh, okay. I wish. <laughs> <laughs>